Hello, my name is Wendy and welcome back to another video. In this week's video, I am sharing our business class experience with Japanese airlines from London Heathrow to Tokyo Haneda. I'll be showing you all the benefits we got from flying in business class. We arrived early in the morning and as soon as they opened for check-in, we headed over to the priority business class queue to drop off our bags. We then headed through the airport to the lounge. JAL business class passengers get access to British Airways lounge. We picked a seat by the window so we could watch the planes and we then went to get some breakfast and coffee. At the lounge there was a self-serving wine section. We were told if we wanted champagne we would need to ask for this. At the other end of the lounge they had another self-serving bar with a wide selection of drinks. There was a hot drink station for tea and coffee. The breakfast buffet had English breakfast fruit, yogurt, bread, and pastries. We then went to the gate. Business class passengers are boarding group two and will be allowed to board after first class passengers.
really nice for sleeping. I feel like this would be a lot more comfortable. Then there are headsets. So normally you get those little uh, ones. In here we get these. So I haven't tried them because I actually have my own with me and it's Bluetooth but I have one of those uh, little Bluetooth connectors so I can connect um, Bluetooth uh, on here. But yeah, I might still try them out just to see what the quality is like. Then the next thing is slippers. So that's really nice, we don't have to wear our shoes for example when we go to the bathroom. So just nice grey slippers, they kind of have like a little bit of cushioning in here. It also comes with this little uh, shoe horn thing. I think that's, that's probably to help you get it back into your own shoes, which is quite nice. Thank you. So, just got a little hot towel delivered, which is uh, quite nice. So, another thing that was given was uh, this little uh, pouch. That off. Uh, in here, so I already had a sneak peek in MLs. There are earplugs, pocket tissues, eye mask for sleeping, a toothbrush set, there is a charger and we already checked so this charger is if you pull this off it's a USB-C underneath which is good for us. Then it comes with this little phone. Um, stand. You can do that, there you go. Then you put your phone and you can stand. But yeah, that's it. That's what's in this little bag. So today I'm wearing this uh, t-shirt that I got for Christmas. It says uh, kawaii, which means cute. And I've already gotten quite a few compliments from everyone who's Japanese, uh, both in the gate and also in the plane. Everyone thinks it's very nice. So here is business class and this here is where you come into my section. The first thing you have over here is the TV area and underneath it is a shelf where I'm currently storing all the, the things like duvet and uh, pillow and underneath it is my bag and my shoes. Here is my seat um, and there's like a wall that you can take down over to where Emil is sitting. So the seats, they fold down completely flat so you can sleep. So in my little cubicle there is uh, two windows and we are sitting just by the wing. Over here on the left hand side I have the controls that control uh, the seats, uh, how I want to sit, the, the little wall in between me and Emil and, uh, and also my reading light. I later learned that these blue buttons are for a lower back massage. Also on my left uh, I have a remote, this is the remote for the TV. This remote can also be used for ordering food from the menu. And down here I have a plug and somewhere to plug in a USB as well for charging. Also on the left hand side I have my table. So I just have to push down, let it come out. And then I have my table. This was our starter. A drink of our choice dried fruit and nut mix, and olives and feta cheese. We then got another meal, which was a mixture of fish, meats and vegetables. I was not particularly a fan of this meal. We also had the option to go for the international menu, but chose the Japanese. I normally love Japanese food, but I do wish I had selected the international menu. We then got another meal. This was fish, vegetable, rice and miso soup.
then got our dessert and a green tea. The dessert was good, but very sweet. We were then given a bottle of water. gotten ready for bed and they have just dimmed the light. I'm just watching a movie now, um, Just uh, it's about 9 o'clock in Japanese time, so uh, I think I'll try to sleep around 10 o'clock in Japanese time instead. Um, so yeah, going to sleep in about an hour. So I'm in the bathroom now, I just wanted to show you. Um, so this is a special bathroom for business class. and. The main difference, uh, I don't know if it's bigger, but uh, the main difference is that over here we have uh, two brushes, uh, so it's like set with the, there's a little toothpaste inside, then there's a little mouthwash and a lotion, face mist and hand sanitizer. And uh, they fill these up all the time, I've already used two mouthwash and yeah, they fill them up um, regularly. Unfortunately, I was not able to sleep more than an hour due to bad shoulder pain and I wasn't able to get comfortable. I then tried ordering some snacks from the menu. I started with a Coke and some ice cream, which was delivered quickly. I later tried the cheese board and some more drinks. Later, when we got closer to Japan, they turned the lights back on and served breakfast. We asked for some yogurt, fruits and tea, but they did have more options. When we landed, it took a little longer than normal to get through passport control, as this was the first time we entered Japan with our new visa and they had to create residence class for us. The last benefit of business class is that our bags was priority and once we got through passport control, all our bags were already on the belt. That is everything for this week's video. Thank you very much for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.